Monday, and it's time to talk technology with our tech expert. That's Luis Alvarez, CEO of the Alvarez Technology Group. Luis, welcome back to the show. Thank you, Mark. How are you today? Doing pretty good. It's Monday, and we're starting off the work week, and uh, lots to talk about in the tech world. In fact, something here that uh, the FBI has issued a warning about ransomware that really is a big thing for our local ag companies. What do you know about this? Agricultural companies have been targeted by ransomware gangs quite actively over the last few years. Because the likelihood of them paying the ransom, since they're what they do is so in the moment, you can't wait a week or two weeks to harvest. <laughs> you have to do it when it happens. And so ransomware gangs know that if they can attack an ag company, they're more likely than not to pay the ransom because they want to get back to work right away. And the FBI has warned that a lot of chatter that they're monitoring indicates that ransomware gangs are going to be actively targeting ag companies across the country, but in particular in uh, the fresh uh, food category because they know that those are the most vulnerable. What are the companies going to do to uh, basically avoid this ransomware? Well, I think a lot of ag companies, I know of at least two ag companies in the last couple of years that have been hit by ransomware and they were down for quite a bit of time and it caused a lot of supply chain issues and and, uh, cost them some contracts because their, their customers moved on to somebody else and never came back. So they're taking their protections very seriously. I've talked to several ag leaders in our community that are very actively involved in making sure sure that their systems are as protected as possible. And, you know, a lot of the customers that our ag companies work with, like Walmart and Costco, are are mandating a lot of these things because they don't want their supply chains to be at risk. So I think in our case here, the bigger companies are doing all the things that they can do to protect themselves. My concern, of course, is uh, the smaller ag companies that look at cybersecurity as something of of an expense rather than an investment. And hopefully this will serve as a warning to them that they really need to step up their protection. That's right. Time to pay attention. Lewis, Alvarez, CEO of the Alvarez Technology Group with us today online, AlvarezTG.com at AlvarezTG is the Twitter handle. And Lewis, the toll-free number for the iTeam. Give us a call at 866-78-ITEAM. That's 866-784-8326.